Principle three of Celebrate Recovery says to commit all my life into Christ's care and control. As we work through the first three steps, step three of Celebrate Recovery is to admit our lives are out of control and unmanageable, and we came to believe that God could restore us. Even after taking the first two steps and admitting that we are powerless over our lives and we need God to take control, it is definitely not easy to take those steps. Principle three is all about taking action. How do we do that? How do we turn our lives over to His will, to our higher power, Jesus Christ? The acrostic for turn is trust, understand, repent, and new life. I am so grateful that Celebrate Recovery is a place where we can gather together, encourage one another, love one another, and feel safe. We strive to offer each other love, encouragement, and support. Jesus Christ is the foundation of Celebrate Recovery and the 12-step program that we work through each year. When we seek Him and fully trust in His goodness and His will for our lives, the healing journey begins. I will take the necessary steps every day in my recovery and choose to allow God to lead me in my journey. And I will put the steps into action because I know the program works. Step one of the program is to admit that we are powerless over our hurts and our hangups. And it helps us to accept where we're at and step outside of denial. I have found a way with Celebrate Recovery because Jesus is there with us in the room. He guides us through our traumas, our hurts, our hangups, our struggles. Today, I continue to celebrate victories in all areas of my life. And I thank Jesus every day for walking with me. I know as long as Jesus is walking with me in my journey, all things are possible. I am an enabler, codependent, have struggled with childhood traumas, have been estranged from family and loved ones, have struggled with addictions, and have tried everything to fill the voids, including neglecting myself in the process. I choose to take the steps and make the effort every day. And as hard as it is, believe me when I say it gets easier and celebrate recovery will become the best place to be on a Monday night. There is room for everyone to heal and grow together with God. My name is Kim, and I invite you to join us at CCLF in the Fireside Room and come and celebrate your recovery with us.